Welcome to Funko. We're here to work on redesigning the intranet for Funko. People make toys here, they don't build SharePoint sites. To fuel our growth, now everything needs to really be done exactly the right way. So over the next three days, the goal is to try to find some projects that we can get completed mm -hmm. and get rolled out into production inside of the company that we can really use. So what we're out here to do is to help get Funko started on a path that will allow them to take advantage of all the really cool new things that are available in Office 365. And we know we want to do some communication-y things, we want to do some team-y things, we'd like them to be replicatable. Essentially what we're doing is building a model so that the sites have sort of a similar look and feel. So I think we're excited about being able to do that first. So you guys have been thinking about yes. what are some departments and or teams that might be good uh, guinea pigs? One of the teams we have is uh, called the Shire, and it's our product development team. I'm Michelle, and I'm the project, basically the project manager, kind of leading the charge. And Trisha is my lead senior business analyst. And together we have implemented a workflow system to track the development of all Funko products. They track it from a concept on a whiteboard of wouldn't it be cool if we did this series of characters through getting all the licenses worked out, mock-ups, approval, manufacturing over in China, and then it comes back and then moves right into selling. We're able to do more products faster and have better data. So we can actually do better analysis. So are you monitoring what's coming out yes, of yes, Hollywood? Yes, To yes. say what There's is... There's discussions months, a year in advance um, with our licensors about what movies they have coming each year. Your finger is on the, the pulse. What's the latest video game that everybody's talking about? What's the movie that everybody wants to, to see? And are you taking a chance that a movie is going to be big? Sure. You have to be synonymous with pop culture. And in order to do that, you have to have the world-class speed to market to get the products out while the pop culture zeitgeist is at its highest. The idea that all of us, no matter where we're at in Funko, all over the world, can all communicate with each other effectively is all super important. But like any other collaboration tools and communication tools, the biggest challenge is how do you organically seed it into everybody's day-to-day -day life so that adoption picks up? Tell someone who's grown up in the SharePoint space that you're not going to ever see a subsite again is really scary. And so the answer to not doing that is the new hub site. So we have the Shire Hub, and this is where we would like eventually everyone to kind of come in. So you want to communicate, you need to roll things up there. And so being able to create families of related sites is super powerful because it allows us to take advantage of a much more efficient and effective governed solution. So plugging into it, we have the communication. Think of this as the place where you want to communicate with the rest of the company. It's the training. It's the training. Yeah. This is a, a place to come and learn about the Shire. Yeah. That's really I what this is. the Shire, okay. what's coming, yep. Right now, every one of these links either points to a Word document mm -hmm. or it points to a wiki page. <laughs> They're rewriting a very large wiki now, and so they're drafting content every day, all day. Yep. So their wiki's getting big, and they're, using, they using, for their they're using the out-of-box wiki pages, because <laughs> that's why you're here, to help us do this all the right way. Here we go. It's really interesting learning how they've adapted technology to solve their problem. And I, Benjamin and I were talking about that it, it isn't the way we would have done it, but it's so working for them. And so you really, as a consultant, you have to come in and say, well, you know, how much of your life am I really going to disrupt? Because it's working for you. How I actually think I know what this could look like. I have a model. We could look at that model. You could say, oh, if you turned that into this and this into that, we'd have your design. We could then build, and then you could start putting content in. Now what we have to do is use the wisdom of Benjamin to really craft <laughs> all of this, this cool stuff on the collab side. Ben, you got a lot more work cut out for you than we originally had planned. I hope you're okay with that. 
Absolutely. Yeah, this is good. <laughs> I knew I had to build a team site. That's great. However, there's a lot of work that goes into it because it was looking at a specific team with specific challenges and giving them a place for them to work for them. Nice. Oh, goodness. This is crazy. <laughs> all, all of this. Thank you, guys. It was kind of like getting hit by a bus being in there because we weren't kind of ready for that much attention. We've been so busy um, working on our system that we just implemented. So having this opportunity um, to build this new site for the company, you know, for our team to support the company is really exciting. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. Well, in three days, I'm going to have the Shire's new sites. We're going to get to see some new site design templates. We're going to get to see some hub sites. We are, of course, going to build out a new power app. We're proof of concepting real time in production on live servers, on Office 365. It feels so exciting to actually be thinking about, can we really do this? It took me more time to get her hooked into it than her to go, all right, move over. We can redo that, we can redo this, we can redo this. It's like, wow.